hi students now i would like to find out the employee salary based on his income okay so just with the help of the few uh, assumptions by taking the some percentages so i am finding here earnings and the deductions as well as the gross salary okay so to accept the my total salary and declare the here at one variable as a long int so when i use and i declare the any variable as a long int so i have to use percentage ld format specified okay then i'm reading the basic salary here that is storing inside the scl variable whenever this salary is above 50000 okay whenever the salary is above 50000 so I'm taking some percentages, something HRA on that salary is the something 9 percentage. Okay. And DA is some 8 percentage and profession tax is something 3 percentage. Some IT is something 2 percentage. Okay. So these are some random values I'm taking. And this is the first condition. For example, if the salary is lies between 40,000 and the 50,000 okay else if it is greater than or equal to 40 and it should be less than 50,000 because whenever it is equal to 50 just I'm calculating the these calculations so whenever it if it is less than the 50 and should be greater than or equal to 40,000 then what I'm doing I'm taking the different percentages for the these things for the HRA, DA, PF, and IT. Okay. Then also, whenever the my salary is lies between this thirty thousand and forty thousand, then I'm taking the other calculation values here. Okay. Then finally, if the salary is below thirty thousand, up to thirty thousand these will be taken and whenever the salary is below 30,000 I am taking the different percentages here and after calculating all those things what I am doing is to calculate the, this completely earnings I am adding the both HRA and DA okay then deductions for the deductions I am doing this PF and IT these are coming uh, considering under the deductions then my what is my gross salary then so salary is the given amount okay earnings is the whatever the additional amount some percentage we are getting under this basic salary hra and da then minus deduction deductions are the, these these two are i am subtracting okay then i am displaying all those values here okay so this is the example for LCF ladder. So else your first condition and the LCF second condition and the LCF third condition else then some statements. Okay. Let us see the output. Just see that my salary is above fifty thousand. Or is that fifty thousand I'm giving? In basic salary HRA is how much percentage I have given there for that one whenever it is the 50,000 some 9 percentage so 4,500 DA is some 8 percentage so 4,000 and PF is 3 percentage So total earnings i'm adding the both 8500 and 3000 this 2000 pf and it uh, so 1500 plus thousand it comes under the deductions 2500 then grass salaries according to the my formula so salary plus earnings plus salary plus earnings minus deductions okay so 50,000 plus earnings here is 
8500 and its deduction is 2500 totally gross salary is the 56000 like this i can calculate the net gross salary of an employee so by taking the different values with the real time data we can perform the operations like this